Andhra Pradesh CM and Chandra Baba Naidu's bold moves, only Hindus to be employed in state temples, wage hike for Archikas on August 29, 2024. Andhra Pradesh Chief Minister and Chandra Baba Naidu made a significant announcement regarding the management and staffing of state temples. In a meeting with the Hindu Religious Endowment Department, CM Naidu declared that only Hindus would be employed in state temples, reinforcing a policy aimed at preserving the sanctity and cultural integrity of these religious sites. CM Naidu introduced a detailed plan to revitalize temple administration and enhance religious tourism across the state. Key aspects of his plan include increased wages, salaries for the 1,683 Arkakas temple priests will rise from 10,000 rupees to 15,000 rupees per month. Support for minor temples, the monthly financial aid for minor temples under the Dupa Deepane Vedyam scheme will be increased from 5,000 rupees to 10,000 rupees. Youth support, a monthly stipend of 3,000 rupees will be granted to youth who have completed Veda Vidya but are currently unemployed. Barbers pay, Nai Brahmins, or temple barbers, will receive a minimum monthly salary of 25,000 rupees. Naidu also announced the formation of a committee involving officials from the tourism, Hindu charities, and forest departments. This committee will focus on developing temple sites, particularly in forested areas, to enhance their accessibility and preserve their natural and religious significance. In addition to these measures, CM Naidu criticized the previous administration's handling of temple affairs, including incidents of vandalism such as the burning of a temple chariot. He emphasized a zero-tolerance stance on forced religious conversions and reaffirmed that only Hindus will be allowed to work in Hindu temples. The CM further committed to recovering 87,000 acres of temple land currently under illegal occupation through legal means. This move reflects his broader strategy to reinforce the role of Hindu institutions in Andhra Pradesh while addressing past grievances and boosting the overall administration of temples in the state.